I'm in grade 10. Hi, I'm Aiden Alexander, and I'm in grade 11. Hi, I'm Kelsey Holmquist, and I'm in grade 11. Uh, I'm Jordan London, and I'm in grade 12 here at East Glen. I chose AP because I was in pre-AP all of junior high, and I just really wanted to push myself more in high school and do the best I could. I chose it mostly because I had an older sister that did it, so it was just kind of seemed like a logical stepping stone. But it also really prepares me for when I go to university because I know the courses, you'll have more homework and you'll have more of the discussions during class time, which is kind of what we do here. Well, uh, in grade 10, when we had real open house, there was a meeting and they do an AP presentation. And at first I wasn't sure, but I heard Mr. Padbrook talk about European history. And I love history. It's what I want to major in next year. So it was just a really good opportunity for me. Uh, I chose AP because I like to push myself to what I can do and I like the extra work. Probably the teachers. I feel like they really draw you into all of the classes and you feel like three hours right now doesn't feel like three hours because you go through so many things, you have all these discussions and the time just flies by. Um, I think it's a good balance between like challenging and like really like learning more in depthly about the subjects. Um, the teachers really want you to success, succeed um, to your best abilities. Uh, you get to find people who are more, think like you, uh, work like you, have the same values as you, and I guess it just establishes a place where you know that you'll be able to fit in. Definitely in math would be the math lab. We get to use that and we get to use all the whiteboards. And in English, we were more collaborative. Like we had novel studies and we also had like novel groups. So we had one that we did as a class, which was sort of like how you would have it in junior high. But then when we had individual ones, it felt like you were really understanding the story better because you were talking with all of your peers, but then you also got to talk with your teacher. So for one, you get to do the AP test, which if you do good on and you don't do good on your diploma, you can replace it with the AP test, which is like a backup plan. Definitely, they're the smallest class sizes. Some may my social class had only eight students, so it was really small. And you feel like you can work together with everyone. Um, we move a lot faster, which is really nice because I like quick paced work. And also you get to really go more in depth with learning. You get to be surrounded by people who push you to do your best. You have the, the best of the best teachers. These are some of the best teachers I've ever had. Uh, I don't know if that's just AP or just East Glen, but I really like the teachers in AP and you just get to be more knowledgeable about the subjects you get to learn. Well, you're a lot closer to your classmates. It's just a closer bond because you take the same courses all through high school. You're closer with your teachers. You can have more in-depth conversations because you, you're together all the time, so you have all these thoughts and opinions and you just have very educated conversations. There's people in there who also are pushing themselves too and have those same goals as you. You can feed off each other, help each other out, and you just always have that extra thing keeping you going. So in grade 11 you do an AP presentation. You're given a topic, Mr. Padbrook gives you a topic that you studied throughout the year and you do research and you do a whole presentation on it and when you go to the U of A we spend all day there and they teach you how to do proper university research, how to use their library, you can get a library card that you can use at any time in high school, even on your own. For grade 10, I definitely tried out and if it's not for you, you don't have to take it all of high school but I definitely try it out in grade 10 because the teachers just want you to succeed and like if you ever feel stressed or like anything they'll help you throughout anything go for it if you don't like it then there's no harm no foul you can you can quit you take the dash one curriculum so it's no harm on you and if you love it you love it all it does is give you extra opportunities I would definitely do um, AP especially if you're Trying to go to university, it really prepares you for the workload. Sometimes it can be a lot, but it's definitely worth it. I would say if you really enjoy your academics, go into AP because you'll be surrounded with people who care about them and you won't feel like an outlier being the only one who cares about your marks. But 
it's not something that you have to do either. Like, you can still get into university without AP. It's just an option you can do in high school. I love it. <laughs> That's really all I have. I just, I love how close everyone is. I love the extra work. I love that it's something that I'm interested in just past the curriculum.